Hello guys, welcome to my channel. Today in this video, I'm going to show you how to fix when fingerprint reader is not working after updating Windows 10 to the latest version on Precision 5530. So the fix is only applicable on Precision 5530. So to fix this problem, you have to go ahead and update Intel Software Guard extension software using Device Manager. So go to the Start menu, then make a right click on Start menu, then click on Device Manager. Expand Software Components. Make a double click on Intel Software Guard Extension Software. And then go to the Driver tab. Click on Update Driver. Then click on Search Automatically for Drivers. And then click on Search for Updated Drivers on Windows Update. This will open the Windows Update. And once the update is installed, restart your computer and then the fingerprint reader should start working but still you are facing the problem then you can go ahead and update fingerprint reader driver from Dell website so copy this link the link is provided in the video description open this link in a browser this will straight away take you to precision 5530 drivers and download page scroll down and click on category and then go ahead and select security from the drop down option and then here you can see goodix fingerprint sensor driver go ahead and download this driver and once the download is complete, you can go ahead and run this exe file and then install the Goodix fingerprint driver. And after that, you can go ahead and restart your computer and that should go ahead and fix the problem. But still you're facing the problem, then go ahead and remove the fingerprint. And then you can go ahead and set up the fingerprint once again. For that, go to the start menu, then click on settings, go to accounts, then click on sign in options. And here you can see Windows Hello fingerprint, click on it. And then here you will see the remove option. So remove the previous registered fingerprint. Now once the previous registered fingerprint is removed, you can go ahead and click on setup and register the fingerprint once again. So one of the steps should definitely help you to get your fingerprint working. So that'll be all. Thank you so much for your time and please like this video and subscribe to my channel.